So after a frosty start across the state of Ohio Monday, we warmed up nicely, but it was chilly. Let's take a look at some of these morning lows Monday. 26 in Newcomerstown, 26 degrees in New Philadelphia and Worcester, 27 degrees down here. And that was downright cold, folks, with a heavy frost. Growing season has certainly ended across much of Ohio. Travelers forecast coming up after your future view map, which looks like this. These are frontal positions as of 8 a.m. Tuesday morning. They have a cold front located in the upper Midwest along with a stationary front. That frontal system will slide its way through the Ohio Valley Wednesday night into the day on Thursday. Slight chance of shower activity, nothing major to be concerned about. And behind it, nothing in the way of majorly cold air. A couple of degrees lower than what Wednesday is going to be like, and Wednesday is going to be a stellar day. Going to be nice. High pressure continues to dominate our weather located across the central Appalachians. It will slide to the east just a wee bit. After that front makes its way through here, then the front will, or the high will make its way back to the southeast, retrograde to the west. And um, it will set up shop once again and give us beautiful conditions for the remainder of the work week. Now. Let's take a look at your traveler's forecast for the state of Ohio for the day on Wednesday. Pretty nice conditions. Partly cloudy skies in the far north, most of sunny to sunny, central and southern Ohio, upper northeast Ohio, mid to upper 60s. Remainder of the state will be in the low to mid 70s for daytime highs, some 10 to 15 degrees above normal for the latter part of October. Let's take a look at your local five day forecast. As you may have noted, Worcester area may have a few showers late Saturday as another disturbance makes its way through the area. Otherwise, we've got a splendid stretch of weather coming up once we get rid of the sprinkles Wednesday night into the day on Thursday.